works. Yeah. So Izzy Moore versus Ludo Victor. We've got the French French match. Yeah, I'm going to say expecting Kami Claw. This should be Kami. interesting because no doubt they've uh, played each other before. Yeah, we used to have practice together a lot. Regularly. Izzy Moore in total darkness right now. <laughs> yeah. yeah, these... Uh, Kind of fitting actually, he's gone to the dark side and picked her for odd kicks. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> okay, we so to your hero. Yeah, it should be interesting to see because uh, you'd think that uh, Claude would be all over Cami, but um, he's keep playing a very strong ground game at the moment. There he goes, goes for the wall dive. Yeah, I think when you get people who play each other so much, it's not the same as your typical matchup because we know each other's styles so well. Absolutely, yeah. Ooh, Ooh, nice, nice shot. Yeah, I think this match probably isn't. I, mean, I reckon Claw wins, but I bet it isn't that bad, to be honest. Kami. Um, I don't know. You, I mean, I think uh, Kami's stand medium punch would be a good anti air, maybe. Yeah, jump forward medium kick's pretty decent because it's upwards. Crown Fierce might work as well because the hitbox is yeah. quite low on that. Well, I mean, the cannon spike goes pretty far if you give a heavy one. That's true. So. Nope. Oh. I, I think I saw him stick the medium oh. punch out there then. <laughs> Crazy cannon spike there. Of course, Cammy has got a touch of death and um, Claw Dizzy's quite easily, so yeah, that might right. come into play. But then again, he's got a bit of an awkward hitbox, so it might not work so easily. Oh! Ooh, I think he went for a flip flash kick there to punish it. But yeah, I wonder if that was the um, the super freeze. Mess up his input and he just got the kick instead. Yeah, maybe. Well, I think for that, for Kami's soup of a drill part, she's invincible. Then when she does the uppercut after, which is actually able to be hit. Yeah, sure. Doing that. So maybe he did it a bit too. Maybe he wasn't well. far, far away <laughs> enough. <laughs> just catches her out of the air. <laughs> yeah. Oh, nice slide, optimal range. Nice flip kick. Yeah, there we go. Gets the second one. Yeah, if you do a heavy flash kick with Claw and it hits twice, you can do one again for an extra one hit. Absolutely. Usually. I mean, no reason not to do it, so just no. do it. <laughs> just do it. <laughs> just do yeah. it. <laughs> like, famous, just do it. Yeah. Famous Nike words. Yeah, just do it. <laughs> Ooh, Devix has switched to his other character now, Ryu. I know he's got a Ooh, strong nice Ryu as well. Taxi. That was beautiful. Oh, I think he wanted to get standing fierce for a close version there, so get him from above. Nice. B. It's quite a bad match for Ryu, I know that. Yeah, I've played this match a little bit and it seems like a bit of a struggle at times. Super. Yeah, only one hit on the Super Life and he's a bit too close. Nice cross up Tatsu. He's catching the top yeah, of his hitbox. Yeah. Yeah, I think in this match you probably want to um, put yourself in the corner as Ryu so you don't have to do execute the Dragon Punch from one side. Yeah, possibly. Make, make life a bit easier for you. Yeah. He has also got the, um, the jump medium punch, which uh, should yeah. catch the uh, wall dive. Interesting how he hopped over to the other side, then shot his super off. Maybe that's his best side. Yeah. Might have given that away then. Oh, standing forward, I think, traded with a dragon punch there. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. I think I'd only actually hit once, but he was forced to block the rest of it. And he died from the chair. Of the first hit, if that makes sense. Yeah. Sort of like how Sagat will only take one hit if he's in the recovery of a low tiger. Absolutely, yeah. Yeah, similar hitbox on Claw's crouching, driving strong. Yeah, I think similar to uh, Zangief, Claw has got a good standing, immediate, fast standing forward, is quite good in this matchup. Yeah, he's shot has a lot of with trouble. the uh, Tatsu, beat the flip kick there. Cross up Tatsu, I should have said. Yeah. Going for the wall dives. Nice block by Ludo Victor. Yeah, Izzy Moore nice. being uh, quite respectful here is not uh, abusing the wall dives, but probably because that, that wouldn't work against Ludo Victor. Yeah, I think that's a sign of a good claw player if you know how to be patient. A lot of claw players when we start off just tend to go in all the time. Oh, good read. But, Ooh, wow, that was a beautiful dragon punch. Anti cross up. That's one of the most satisfying things in SC when you do the dragon punch and it hits from behind like that. Yeah, I've seen moments before where people have like literally been behind, like Ryu or Ken, and the shot still gets them in the face in the wrong way. Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> Yeah, the hitbox on the DP in this game is pretty nice. <laughs> Certainly is. Yeah. Of course, it's not nice when you get tagged oh, by it. Oh, slide straight into the fireball. Nice punish. Yeah, that cross-up Tatsu seems quite good in this match because Claw's quite tall, isn't he? Yeah, it generally is um, decent against tall characters. Yeah, like uh, Boxer. Yeah, absolutely. 
and Sagat as well, actually. Yeah. yeah. And I think because um, Claw's flip kick is like a directional input, like yeah, it's down hard. back to well, forward. Well, it's quite, it doesn't go as high as Guile's flash kick, so it'll make whiff up like all the time as well. Well, because it's like left to right in effect, when you cross them up, you'll lose charge. Yeah, that's all right. So that's why you can't anti-air it easily. Ooh, super. That's going to be it, yeah. But of course, um, Claw has got the evasive flip kicks on punch and kick, so if yeah, maybe that's you can right. do... Um, do the input and press all three. My option select, I don't know. Yeah, I've seen some uh, match videos where like, you get claw players playing against Shirtos. Well, like, get up to him and we knock him down, do the free kick backflip. Yeah. And, like, bit of DP and then punish it. Very nice. Yeah. Yeah, interestingly, I've not seen him use that at all. Um, so maybe it's not very good. Don't know. Well, I think if uh, Ryu play oh, our. Some good stabs here. Oh, we went for the cross up again. <laughs> yeah. Have to watch out for that. Very tricky. Right, oh, standing medium kick, nice. Yeah, standing medium kick, classic move that uh, stuffs quite a lot yeah, of Yeah, it gets shot a lot of problems. Yeah, because it'll beat the, I think there was a video where Dan Bly was explaining that it'll beat the lower medium kick and also the sweep as well. Yeah, it should, would, should also beat viable startups. Yeah, it can if we're close enough, yeah. Nice bait. Nice, yeah, a lot of bait, yeah. Yeah, weak roll to get close, that was good use. So yeah, and beats off like kick. Oh, nice. Standing short. <laughs> Oh, ooh, that's unfortunate. Oh, Spike lands him in some trouble there. Oh, he gets away with it. Oh. oh. That's... Uh, yeah, Ludovic to under a lot of pressure right now because he Simon's at match point. Absolutely. Wow, straight up into uh, the DP. Okay, so he's got the knock down. Oh. Great reactions from Ludo Victor here. Nice, and he's got the super. That's, That's going to do a lot of damage. Straight there. Yeah. Nice little bit of panic in there. He's just thrown out the super. Oh, oh that was unfortunate. That's bad. Bad decision. He's calm down. Nice Tatsu. Lost the mix up. Oh, and again. <laughs> Stays in it. Miniature pop off right there. Is he right. not looking uh, too happy with that? <laughs> no, I, I, can't, I kind of understand how he feels like those yeah. situations. Like, oh, I should have won that, but... <laughs> he, had it <laughs> yeah. he thought he had it wrapped up and then he... Yeah. Uh, I like the colour that Isimon uses for claw as well, the... Uh, you want to hold the white one? Yeah, white one. <laughs> of course, nothing will ever beat but black and red claw, but... That's yeah. best. So, Ryu taking a lot of damage already, about 30%, maybe 40 I suppose if from mid-range, uh, standing fierce from close, probably pretty good to trade with Fireball Startup or beat it. Um, yeah, range on it. I suppose that would work. Yeah. Well, yeah, because Claw players use it on Guile a lot, so I figure it'd be all right in this match as well. Oh, I think that was a super input. Yeah, you got a DP instead, though. I think he went for the low medium punch to put him into the uh, the hit stun because there's good frame advantage on that, and then went for the super. Oh, just catches him. Wall dives. Yeah. Very close to the match right now. Oh, just blocks it. Oh, baits it. Oh, Ooh, stand fierce. I think he went for a throw there. Yeah. But I think Issy has just about not landed yet, so he got standing fierce. That's what he looks like, yeah. Wow, good block on the wall dive there. Nice trade. Ooh, another trade. Interesting. So it is more with the faking out wall dives there, just to uh, try to make him throw out a DP, and then he's doing the uh, low medium punch to punish the DP. Oh, oh that's not a good that was, that was lucky. bad time. <laughs> just recovered Ooh, the time. Wow. Oh, that was interesting. <laughs> We're going to see a wall spike, the classic. No? Oh, what? No. Yeah, wall spike's quite good if you have a lot of health because it'll trade if pretty much anything. Yeah, and it, it comes so quickly that Yeah, you really just never expect it. <laughs> Yeah, I despise that wall spike so much, it's so <laughs> irritating. <laughs> okay, so both players at match points is very tense right now. Oh. Nice. Just waiting for uh, Ludo Victor to throw out a misjudged DP. Oh, are we going to see an end? Oh no, blocks it. No. Ooh, standing strong. I don't think I've seen Izumon go for a single. Oh, nice! That was beautiful. 
Oh, such oh. a good read. Oh, oh nice. Oh, <laughs> takes it. Yeah, 3-2. It's a nice win there by Ludo Exa. Yeah, very well played. 